Welcome back to the Photoshop Shortcut Series. I'm Spencer and I scoured the internet for all the Photoshop shortcuts. I know there's a lot of them. Let's get started. In this video, we're going to look at the Save and Save As shortcuts. So let's open up a new document. It can be any size, doesn't matter. We're just going to look at Save and Save As. So up in the file dropdown, we have Save and Save As. Currently, save is grayed out. Why is that? Because it's a new document. Save means you're gonna save something to a spot in which you've previously saved it. If you opened up a new document, you're not gonna have that option. It's gonna be grayed out. So we're gonna have to use the save as feature the first time we save a document. And that shortcut is Shift Command S. So I'm gonna go ahead and use it, Shift Command S, and that brings up the save dialog. And it's really massive on my screen for some reason, so I'm gonna scale it down a little bit. In the save dialog, you can select whether or not you wanna save it as a Photoshop or other image slash Photoshop file formats. There's all sorts of different options here. So I'm just gonna save this to the desktop. And now, oh look, save is still grayed out. That's because we haven't made any changes yet. So if I just grab this brush and draw on the canvas a little bit, notice that the save option is now lit up. It's no longer grayed out. So we can use that and that's Command S. By the way, for you uh, PC users, Shift Control S is what Save As would be on a PC, and Control S to just save. It's as easy as that. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more creative content, don't forget to check out our channel and subscribe for weekly updates. If you want to learn more shortcuts, be sure to check out our shortcut series playlist for Adobe Photoshop, Illustrator, and InDesign.